Hey guys. Well, um, we always do things very last minute and we never know where we're gonna end up going at all until the last minute. So last minute we found out we going home. We didn't, it just happened last night to be honest. We figured it out. Pretty much what ended up happening was because as we've been moving around, we've been using Google Fi and that's been our, how we've been getting our internet while well, we've been going to all the, all the countries that we've been to. Well, they turned it off because it says we've been away from back home for 90 days. So we turned it off and we just said we were not in the mood to try to figure out like getting the SIM card and the internet and everything. Cause we just started moving for so long in a particular way. We just said, we didn't feel like changing it up. So we said, we just gonna wrap it up. We, Cause the goal to be honest was, I guess I'll let you guys know, was we didn't want to return by November. A, an extra month so our thing turned off a month earlier than we wanted to, but it's okay. But we could have tried to drag it on, but we, it's, it's been going for a long time. We just said we've been comfortable moving around with internet. And, and let me tell you what I mean when I say that. Oh, what I mean, hold on. We love using our internet. We used it because we usually would kind of gauge, we'll see how much it is to get somewhere through Uber, and then we'll call a taxi. And at least we'll know how much we're negotiating with, you know, instead of them saying like 500 and it was really like 100, you know? So it gave us a peace of mind that way. And we just got comfortable with it. Like it became like our right arm. And I don't want to cut off my right arm. <laughs> so that's how I feel about it. And we were like, it's fine. But we're excited for the next chapter. Because just because the traveling right now, it, at least full-time traveling, is coming to an end, does not mean we have at least some exciting things that we want to try. Okay. We're on our way trying to find somewhere to eat and enjoy our last day. Okay. Because um, we don't have our... GPS. We just try to cut. I mean, we don't have the connection. We just winged it. Just went, saw a taxi man, and was like, "Take us somewhere to get." We just said restaurant, like you know, just saying food. He took us to the mall of this stuff. But we've already been here, but we it's said perfect. it's perfect because we have a variety of foods, and there's a few things we want to try again. And I want to have like I've been saying I want to have baklava. It's been amazing, and just other little foods I want to try. But at the same time, we also wanted kind of some diff not all the way here, we wanted something different. But it's just, how can I put it? It's just different without the connection. I forgot what these are called. Gourmet. Gourmet, I believe. It's really good. When it's hot. Yeah, this one is way, this one is way better than the first one we had got because I guess the other one wasn't wasn't so fresh the first time we got it. But this one was like piping hot, fresh from the oven. So this one is really delicious. Mm -hmm. And it's just a simple one too. Now we're going on a taxi ride. We're trying to get back. <laughs> and he getting agitated because he's not sure where. But we over here like, we just ready to get back. What's the thing?
<laughs> All I know is like Uber has made traveling around the world, not just Uber, just a lot of these ride apps. They made traveling around the world, just traveling in general, so much convenient and easy. Because trying to move around without Uber, or just matter of fact, no phone internet. connection, no, internet, no connection. internet. Oh my God, too difficult. Like I couldn't even see. I, lucky enough, I kind of remember where home was and from the last time, from the last place we stayed at. So I knew how to get here from up over there. Once I start seeing familiar stuff, you know. So, but um. And then the taxi driver, he was like so pissed off. And I don't know why. You know, I asked him a whole bunch of times. He's like, you know, this place, everybody always say yes, but they never know, you know, they they, they never know where exactly the place is. And then whenever they can't find it, they seem to get a little aggravated with you, even though the meter is running and they getting paid. I don't get it. So it's kind of like, in my head, I'm like, they probably just be doing that just to run the meter up. But the meter wasn't even running. It was running. Oh, it was? Yes, it was running. But, I don't know, man. To me, this is, this is, if you don't have this device here working the, properly. Internet. Connection. Internet, internet. Got nothing. Got nothing. So, I'm just glad we actually found our way back and back home where we need to be. And that'd be the end of that. I know y'all was used back that word. The baby wouldn't stop screaming. It was a lot. He's screaming. The driver, he mad, slamming stuff and everything. And it was a I'm horrible just, ride. I'm just, I was trying to just keep my composure because I wanted to get mad at him for doing the most. But I'm like, damn, we need to get home. I don't want him to just drop us up on the side of the road somewhere, you know, where we don't even have no working, our, no working phone. So it was a lot. So I'm glad we made it. I guess we just need to go ahead and finish finish packing up and go ahead and uh head on back to the states for a little bit until we head on out again later <laughs> the dogs are so big so bulky and, and these are like stray animals but they all are so lucky they have tags on them to let you know that they've been Got these shots and stuff like that. For rabies. Yeah. It is actually fresh. That's a fresh room right there. It's one thing I love, the community around here, they take care of their animals. It should be. Yeah. Alright guys. Packing up our belongings to Head on back home. <laughs> but no, uh, no seriousness. It's just one o'clock. We have a, our, we have a, our flight is at um, eight a.m. But of course, you know it's always best to be at the airport early. So we're gonna be leaving here at what three o'clock, and by the time we get to the airport, it'll be four o'clock. So to give us enough time to get there and do whatever it is we need to do while we're there. But um. Yeah. Hopefully this bag is not overweight because you don't want to be dealing with that. Lucky enough, this one here has this been has this right here has been saving us. I know you can weigh at some airports. Some airports have scales where you can weigh your bags before you get up there. But to be quite honest, out of all the airports we've been to, I probably only seen maybe one or two airports that had scales, you know, where you can just weigh your stuff before you went up to the counter. Other than that, I do not want to be them people where we at the counter, we put our bag on the scale and it's overweight. Like how many times have we seen that? With the, somebody bag is overweight and everybody was just trying to take stuff out, put clothes on and all that. Uh, you do it now. You do it early, you weigh it ahead of time so you don't have that problem when you get to the airport. So, yeah. Let's see the weight. Let's see. I, I'm a little nervous with this one because it's, 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 it's heavy. 
it's heavy. Where do we need to be at? 50 pounds. So I'm hoping we had 50 pounds. Oh, but yes. I, I have a bad feeling though that we are. <coughs> so if we are, I don't know what we're gonna do. Clear it out. Just yep. a little bit. This one is something small. That's it. Two guys. No. Oh. That's fine. It depends on who we 50 get. Fifty or five. Yes, it depends on who we Stop get. Stop playing. I'm for real. There's some people who will trip. I will say. That wing scale has been handy dandy to us. <laughs> Take three. Good enough for us. <sighs> Man. <sighs> so, anyway, yeah, now that we got this situated. Little porcupine. Yeah, I get that from all these. Okay. She be she be nice and mean to put your fight at the same. She be nice for two seconds, giving you cuddles, and two seconds later she tossing it out like a ball. <laughs> it does look like a ball though. Kind of is. It's back, so it's stuck. Yeah, it takes two of us to close it. <laughs> Hopefully they don't throw it badly. So we want to try to check this bamboo in. That's for sure. Huh? I said that's for sure. Uh, hopefully it don't bust. Hopefully not. That's why some a lot of people we see, you know, they put that wrap around it. Mm -hmm. Keep it, keep it closed, protect it. Oh, there was one time we saw when it was coming to a conveyor belt, one yeah. bag was like completely busted and broken. I'm not it was bad. tragic. Sometimes the airline, you spend all that money with the airlines and they just treat your stuff any kind of way sometimes. Mm -hmm. It sucks. But we are done packing. We never rest before a travel day. Never do. Thank God this is a, like a one shot yeah. wonder. One shot wonder. Yeah, this is actually going to be like our longest flight. Our longest flight. Out of all the flights we've been on, this one was. 12 hours, 13. 13 hour flight. Before our yeah. longest was nine hours. Nine hours. And I was going to Miami Belize. to Morocco. Yeah. But other than that. I'm a little nervous. Me too. Because she. <laughs> she older and she be acting yeah. up now. Yeah. So it'd be nice if we get on this and we do have like a lot of empty seats on there. Please. That'd be nice. And that way we kind of lay her down like we did the last time. But this time that we got three seats. We can still find. I'm saying, even if the row is over there empty, you move oh, over there with her, true. or I move, you know what I mean? Like how we did in the, was it Singapore, whichever one it was. I think so, I'm not too sure. That was nice. But Turkey has been fun. It was. I feel like we didn't get to do everything we yes, wanted to do. Unfortunately, but there's always another time another to come time. and redeem our yeah. turkey trip. I know if, if, we, if I said we had to redeem any places, it'll be Turkey for sure. And El Salvador. It'll be El Salvador. And it'll be um, maybe maybe Thailand because we missed a few days there. Oh. Would you say would you think Thailand? Because Thailand went by kind of quick. To be honest, there's a lot of countries that yeah. the Asia trip was. Yeah. yeah. It was a lot of hustle and really bustle. Was. So. Really was. I mean, I guess we could always, but you know what? The good thing is time is on our side. Yes. Hopefully health stays on our side as well. Yeah, that's most important. And. Hopefully we can get another chance. Yeah. And All I know is this time here went by so fast. What? what? Just our time moving around and traveling. Oh, I know. It just seemed like it just went by in a blink of an eye. I know. I'm going to say it's been 10 months. Even though we're like two days shy. Well, well we pretty much started in January. Though. We did start. Not yeah. pretty much. We, well, we did, did start. Mm -hmm. But because we're not hitting October 1st here. Mm. It's only like two days, mm. and I'm like, you know what? We're claiming it. <laughs> We've claimed it. It's ten months. Yeah, it has been one hell of a journey. It has been one 
It's a roller coaster. Yeah, it was fun. As much as I was against kind of doing it, the whole thing, you know, I mean, I really had. It was just, it was just, it was just, it was pretty cool being able to like go around and like just see the other side of the world and how they live, you know. So. So how are you feeling now that you ended up going? I, I mean, I feel I'm glad that I went. You know, I'm glad it all worked out. I'm glad I was we all was together. Mm -hmm. You know, and um, I mean, at least we have the videos to look back on. You know, mm -hmm. it was it's a good thing that we actually was doing the videos. Yeah. To, you know. I mean, it's cool, the whole YouTube thing, you know, whatever, but it's we, was, we was also doing that for ourselves, too. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it wasn't just to get a million views or nothing like which, you know, it's cool and whatever, but it was it was for us. It was for us. Day, and, you know? and, and I think that's what justified it for us to continue, be, at least videotaping. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I guess when you look at the YouTube numbers and it's a little discouraging, Yeah. you, you remind yourself, this is for us to look back, because guess what? Let a few months go by you're gonna start forgetting the little tiny things mm -hmm. you know easily and quickly yeah especially going back with the hustle and bustle yeah know? and then Mombi, she has something to look back at for when yeah. she was because you could see her progression from when it was I know, started it's crazy. till now i know i and, know that time went by. i mean just the girl she talking she walking she eating she you know she doing what she want to do now mm -hmm. you know and it's just oh yeah she do <laughs> you know, she said no i'm doing what i want to do and you feel like well that's okay but <laughs> i i will say this just because the travels is done does not mean we're going to stop making videos yeah we're going to try our best to make videos and 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 you know keep doing our thing you know yeah and even even if it's just our little quirky cooking videos or whatever you know yeah it would be pretty much just us how life is now going back after travel mm -hmm. and what we're going to do next in that situation and i think i'm excited to find out for my own self because yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we ain't here <laughs> yeah, nah, but anyway we'll, we'll get it all right yeah but um so yeah at first we was planning on staying out a little bit longer yeah but you know we ended up we, we was we was um we had our phone plans was with google five and unfortunately, they good, but yeah, unfortunately, they ended up um, cutting us off. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. You know, I guess you only allow them to be out the country for three months or whatever, or to, and, and and use international data. And we, funny enough, we've been very lucky throughout this whole year. Yeah. Because when our three months was almost over, we came back to Miami real quick. Yeah. So it refreshed then, mm -hmm. and then when we left, when we left, yeah. my phone broke, and so when my sister came, she was able to help me switch it out. So it gave me, mm -hmm. gave us an extra yeah. three months. When his his phone finished for three months, I got mine, and that would have held yeah. us up until now. Until now, we've been actually very lucky because yeah. it just happened by coincidence. Yeah. It was, and this is why I say it was a roller coaster. Yeah. Roller coasters are exciting. But you know, you get so scared and terrified and woo, and then when you're done, you're like, it was so much fun. Mm -hmm. All that bouncing and everything. Granted, it was something else during it, yeah. but it's exciting. Yeah. We are happy we did it. Yeah. Let's go again, type of video, <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah. But I'm not gonna lie, a part of me, I'm gonna be excited about not packing and unpacking. Yeah, <laughs> that has time. been a little bit of a. Of a we got used to it, yeah. but just, I think being in Kenya for so long and not having to worry yes, about that, yeah. you kind of enjoyed it. That's true. But at the same time, you kind of enjoy the packing sometimes because you're like, we're going yeah. somewhere. And I don't know, so he was like, well, well how often y'all are moving? Well, at first, whenever we first started traveling, we was actually booking Airbnbs for like oh, yeah, our right. full length of stays. Yeah. But sometimes when you do that, you end up booking at a spot well, yeah. that you're not really comfortable being at. Mm -hmm. So instead of us doing that, we started booking like three days or four day stays. Mm -hmm. And if we wanted to extend it, if it's still available, we can. If not, then we could just easily just move around to another one and hope that we, you know. That's true. A lot of times, so, a lot of times, the places did allow us to extend yeah. because they were. It was like off season, so they there was nobody there, so they allowed us. Mm -hmm. But here, it's booked like crazy because yeah. we were moving kind of fast after four days. But it was fun. Turkey was big. We we're gonna move to a completely different city. Yeah. Gonna... Anyways, but yeah. But other than that, we had an amazing experience. Um, we had a lot of highs and we had a lot of lows. But that just all comes with the game. 
If anything, um, go ahead, finish. And yeah, it was just, it was cool, man. You know, I mean, we pack it now, like, like we have literally have an hour before we have to go. <laughs> And like, it just, I know whenever we go home and I know that first morning I wake up in the morning, I'm going to have to be like, did we really just do that? Was you know what I mean? That we woke up from we, 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 we really just did that. I you know. know. So that'd be pretty cool. But You know, I heard some yeah. people didn't believe we were going to be able to do this. <laughs> Uh, well, hey, let them believe what they want to believe. Or yeah. they thought we were going to do like a two weeks and come back. And that um, was it. We, we, we thugged it out. <laughs> <It's that. laughs> but, but at least it still worked out because we did want to go home for the holidays. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. I guess I'm glad you ended up coming with us. You know, because before, if you watch, it, for anybody who watched from the very beginning, Drew did not want to come. And I had. But I'm glad he came. You know what I mean? Right? Mm-hmm. Call me up. Bring it in. Bring it in. Oh. My Bill Cosby face. What? The hug? All of that and Drake coming and stuff is cool. But you brought it up too. Yeah, but it's cool. But anyways, on that case, we are going... I'm gonna try to lay down. Not, not sleep, just relax, lay down. I'm up. I, I, I'm up. Because mm -hmm, he took a nap earlier today. Those don't count. Yes, it does. A little two hour nap don't count. But pray for us for this long flight. And yeah. this girl got a lungs on her now. And mm. she said, I don't gotta sit in this chair. Like, I'm. she was easier to travel with when she was younger. It's crazy. It's crazy was, how it goes. And people be scared to travel with young babies. I that's feel like the best time to do it. They were she was so easy yep, in the beginning. She yep, would just sleep. Yep. Now she's like, hi, oh, hi, oh, hi, oh, hi, oh, hi. You telling me I can touch this now? You telling me I I can do this? I know how to do this. You know, she's at that learning stage in life where she's like, I can touch it if I want to, and I'm gonna go touch it. <laughs> that's how it is now. But at the end of the day, I still love it. Yeah. She's still a trooper to us. Yeah. Till the vet, yeah. from the beginning till now. Yeah. She was. She was. She was so amazing. All right. On that case, I will see you either on the plane or at our destination. Hello. <laughs>